What's going on YouTube? Gsno right here. So in today's video I have some important news to talk about. For those of you who are interested in jailbreaking, Apple has released iOS 14.4.2 and iPadOS 14.4.2. A brand new update which only fixes one security vulnerability but it's an important one. It's a WebKit vulnerability which means that it affects Safari and it can be triggered remotely. So it says in here quote, processing maliciously crafted web content may lead to universal cross-site scripting and Apple is aware of a report that this issue may have been actively exploited. So this is basically everything that iOS 14.4.2 brings. So it's definitely jailbreakable with CheckRain at this moment. Of course, Uncovered Jailbreak cannot jailbreak iOS 14.4.2 because the vulnerability from Uncovered has been patched on 14.4, but the CheckRain should definitely support it. Now, many news articles say that you should definitely update your device right now because the iOS 14.4.2 is out and it's a major vulnerability and so on. Well, while while it is indeed a major vulnerability, if you're interested in jailbreaking your device, you should definitely not update. But yeah, if you're not interested in jailbreaking your device and you care more about your device's privacy and security, then you should definitely update your device to 14.4.2. However, if you want to jailbreak, you should definitely stay lower than 14.4.2. So even though we have no news from CheckRain team, they seem to be rather inactive at this point. Their last update was back on January the 1st. We do know that the CheckRain jailbreak does work for the 14.4.2 out of the box, even though in here it says that it's compatible with iOS 14.3 and lower. You can download the CheckRain 0.12.2 and of course you will be able to jailbreak right away your device with no problem. As I said, there hasn't been any update to CheckRain, it just so happens that the CheckRain that we have still works with 14.4.2 because CheckRain uses a bootroom exploit called CheckMate and that one cannot be patched by Apple. So they may break other components for example the kernel patches which need to be redone but the main exploit cannot be patched on CheckRain so we will always have CheckRain jailbreak. That's a little bit of trivia for those of you who are new. But yeah iOS 14.4.2 is now out and 14.4.1 is also available and of course you can get both of them at this point but probably 14.4.1 will stop being signed soon. So if you want to jailbreak right now with the CheckRain jailbreak you can do so but if you want to use Uncover it's not compatible and the best thing you can do right now now is to stay lower than 14.4.2 and even 14.4.1. If your device is on 14.4, definitely stay there, you have more chances. Although if you are already jailbroken, then definitely stay on 14.3. So I'm going to jailbreak my device with the CheckRain jailbreak here and I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do. So if you want to jailbreak, you can definitely use CheckRain here, the user interface, and you would have to basically go to options and press allow untested iOS and you have to press skip A11 BPR check if your device is A11 and you would just have to follow the instructions in there. But you can also use the terminal version if you want to which is available on applications checkrain.app contents macOS checkrain and it looks like this and you can navigate with your keyboard arrows. The mouse also works sometimes but not always so yeah you can navigate with the keyboard. This is useful if you need a terminal version but this also works on Linux. Actually yeah a very important note is that checkrain is not available for Windows. It's only available for Linux and for macOS. OS. And this is not going to work with the A12 or A13 or even A14 devices, so you should keep that in mind. So here you can enable the um, untested iOS and then you can skip BPR check if your device is A11 indeed and then you go back, you press start, next and your device will enter recovery mode. At this point you're going to see the laptop icon and the power cable and you're going to have to follow the instructions on screen to put the device in DFU mode. So in this case we're just going to have to follow what it says in there and now the jailbreak will start. Your device will boot and that's basically it, the standard check rain procedure. So I'm going to be right back on the device and show you how you can continue it. So just like any other version of check rain on any other iOS version, you just need to open the check rain application here and install Cydia if you don't have it installed. I already have it installed so there is no problem with that. So yeah, the jailbreak works right out of the box. Every single application works with the jailbreak as you can see. My application here works. Let's do a scan. And yeah, as you can see it only takes a couple of seconds now because I have updated it and it can now scan very very fast. So there we go. Do I have malware? Yes I 
do because I put it in there for testing purposes. It's this one here. So you can see that everything works with the jailbreak, no problem, even new term and so on. So there is really nothing different compared to the other versions of the uh, check rain. However, it does work. We can confirm it works with 14.4.2. And as you can see, it does have Cydia and tweaks running perfectly fine. So there you go. So yeah, that's basically it. Speaking of the iSecure OS, however, yes, I have updated it. And if you want to grab it, you should definitely do so. It's a good iOS security application that you can use in order to check if your device is infected with malware and so on. So definitely get it and check out your device. But yeah, other than that, check rain does work pretty fine with the 14.4.2, 14.4, 14.4.1 and so on. However, you should keep in mind that the check rain application doesn't work with the 14.5. By the way, if you're interested in the theme that I'm currently running, it's called Mojito, created by Dennis Bednar. May he rest in peace. So definitely check it out. It's available on Packix, I think. So yeah, thank you for watching. I am Gia Snow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated. And you should definitely keep in mind that the check rain jailbreak doesn't work on the A12 or A13 or A14 devices. This jailbreak works only on iPhone 10 and lower. Keep that in mind. So yeah, thank you for watching. I am Gio Snow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.